very impressed with the organization and incredible uh, attendance. Uh, but I, I wasn't aware that there's such a big blockchain community in Istanbul and pleasantly surprised by the interest, by the attendance and by depth of knowledge actually of the opportunities and sort of case studies that are out there and, and how much is being done in Turkey in, to begin with. Of course not. What does Everex do? Everex is a payments um, technology that enables uh, the tokenization of uh, fiat currency and uh, it rides on a trend to effectively enable blockchain payments to take hold for the traditional economies and, and fiat um, currencies. It's a very powerful trend obviously with um, especially in emerging markets where you see a significant portion of the GDP being devoted to fees, FX rates and what have you to pay internationally and it's also a very limiting factor since a uh, majority of global payments are done in US dollars, effectively uh, forcing trade to go in a certain direction. Whereas if um, you can trade with your neighbors, uh, for example, Turkish lira against Iranian real, or Turkish lira against Azerbaijan, you know, Turkish lira against ruble, Turkish lira against Bulgarian lev, Turkish lira against euro in Greece, it'll be a lot easier to conduct international trade and do cross-border payments Wherever payments are easy, business flourishes. Wherever payments are difficult, business is very difficult. And especially in this day and age where small and medium-sized companies have been put in a significant disadvantage, uh, the way they, they currently bank, for example. We can actually spend hours on, on, the, on the topic. We, uh, there, there's so much um, sort of so, social injustice in the, in the way the current payment system is set up. Um, that it needs a significant overhaul in a way that neighbors can trade with each other and develop uh, opportunities with each other. So my personal mission in life is to create a payment slash FX system that enables any two countries to trade with each other. Um, we have the One Belt, One Road, for example, developed in um, a Asia, which makes moving of goods significantly faster but the payment for those goods is actually slower than the movement of the goods. Clearly an opportunity there. So um, uh, what I've been working on is creating a payment infrastructure that can enable a Turkish firm to pay a Chinese firm in 14 seconds, not a month the way it currently could, could take. I think uh, there's a massive uh, opportunity globally, but especially in emerging markets, to be able to trade with each other. So I see the growth coming up from small and medium-sized entrepreneurial ventures that are looking to grow internationally um, and be able to trade with, for example, Turkish firms being tra trading with Africa or with the rest of Asia and vice versa. Uh, so the development of inter-emerging um, markets trade, I think will be the next 10 year trend which um, for that to, to happen you need easy payments and for easy ha um, payments to happen we need blockchain payments effectively.